Hello everyone. I'm gonna show you how I'm going to clean the shark vacuum and the filter as well. So you see that I did not clean for a long time, like months. So that's how it looks like. It's so dirty now. I'm gonna take them off. Go. This is how I'm gonna take off. Is from the handle. There you go. The handle. The canister. So I'm gonna dump the canister and this filter in here this one it's very dirty so you remove that as well so you're gonna wash it off there you go how dirty it is because it's been a while and there's one more piece there you're gonna remove that as well so I'm gonna put this in the water in the soap This one you just simply pull out like that and put it in a water and soap and this one I, I will wash it with them here so since I don't know how to remove I'll just cut the the hair that's hanging in there because that's the way that I know how to clean I don't want to mess up the screw I don't want to mess up the screw because I know I'm not a fixer so the way that i can clean is just using the seesaw so let me just hang that in a canister so i can i know some other can just remove that and clean it up easily but i cannot so anyway that you know how to do it is better because this one it stops cleaning the carpet if there's a lot of hair see the brush full of hair right there see how many how much hair i've lost in over six months from the carpet only how much more the whole house all my hair is fallen so i cannot i don't like to use gloves when i'm doing this kind of stuff because gloves is kind of it goes slide and i cannot really clean when i have gloves oh my goodness see how how much hair is that I'm sorry, my shadow is in there. See how much hair? Oh my goodness. Oh. That's a lot of hair. There you go now after i put soap and water like three times because it was so dirty now there you go that's the there's the filter and there's the another i don't know how they call you call this but i think this also filter so i'll just gonna hang it
there you go guys the roller is very clean i already cut the hair so it's back to normal now no more hairs on the brush now this is the filter that goes here i've washed already it's been dry so let's put that back there and this as well so has been clean and dry clean and dry there you go so you just insert that there you go and put it back so it's the round thing first before this and the canister very clean there you go so you just put the canister back as well there it clicks and it's fixed now so your shark vacuum is ready for cleaning thank you for watching everybody i hope you clean your filter too